Hey guys, Wolverine 1231 here, and today, this is episode number seven. The freaking coolest game ever that lasted a full 10 or 11 years. And now it's gonna become like, I don't know. Let's see. The game came out in 2008. All right, let's see, 2020 minus 2008 is 12. So the game is 12 years old almost. We're not five. Huh, that game is uh, 14. Oh, I see him right there. No. <laughs> here. <laughs> what am I doing? Freaking making videos, that's what I'm doing. Do a barrel roll and completely fail it. <laughs> Sucks. <laughs> Alright, where are you, LM Classic, aka Ferrari P4? I'm searching for that $20 million rear bumper. There you are, $20 million. I'll just take... You suck! <laughs> I just want to go head on with this guy. Come on, head on! Damn it! Ugh. Oh, you suck, AI. Hey, Alright, come here. I know your tricks. Oh yeah, no car can handle like that behind the wheel of an AI. Has been delivered to your junk Freaking beautiful. Third favorite, I guess. So yeah, this is episode number seven of Burnout Paradise. Version Cagney Bikes. Davis, I think. It's rather Cagney or Davis. I'm not sure. I mean, if you want, you can comment down below and let me know which version this is. And yeah. We got the Burnout Roadster, which looks absolutely nice. It did not come with alternate wheels, though, sadly. But you know what? A car is a car. Accept it. <laughs> this is the $20 million car. Maybe even $100 million. Who knows? It's a car built in the, in the uh, mid-60s. Maybe late 60s or early 70s. So yeah, LM Classic, let's do this. At least it still runs. I kinda like the sound of this car. And you know what sound I like more in this car? The 1.0 sound. I'm a flying freaking pelican. Not really. It's a bird. <laughs> no, it's a dead 60s car. Super jump fail. Don't care. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna. You know, actually, let's do a let's do a freaking stunt run. Why not? This car is. This car can't do barrel rolls, but it can do flat spins. Outrageous jumps, rolls, spins, and drifts to beat the target score in the time limit. Let's go. All the stats are the same. Like, since 1.0. Whee! Oh, land it, land it! Yeah, boy! Oh, I'm definitely winning this one. Boost it, boost it, yes! I 
Out of my way, traffic car. It's time to spin around. Nailed it. I got my front bumper is ripped off. <laughs> Driving backwards. Boy. Let's see how much more we can get. Oh, Jesus. Oh, come on, Driftle. Ah, crap. I can't get that one. Look at the next jump. Probably destroy it. Actually, no. That has got to freaking hurt. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, a million. Win. Got the Millionaire's Club, boys. <laughs> Such a beautiful game. We're gonna see if we can do, like, any other races. Let's do this one right here because it's closest. Let's head up to the Race baseball. To the Coast no, 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 no. HQ. In Coast Guard HQ, where the uh, NASCAR track used to be. I can make it. Like a full boost bar, baby. Not really. If I get the Annihilator, I am hoping that it's going to be a very, very clean car. See you right there, Tempesta. Ferrari against Lamborghini. God damn it! After touch. That would have been an after touch if uh, they kept it. I mean, it makes kind kind of makes sense because all the AI is just gonna move out of your way and then completely just avoid you. Not in my watch, sucker. Gotcha. Car takedown, bro. Jump. I just wish the physics of this game were like the uh, E3 2007 version. Because if, if they were like that, that would be amazing. Well, we have won this race. I don't think we'll be getting another car soon. Maybe after another. Ton you know, there's of lots group. of stuff to do in Paradise City outside all that racing and road rage stuff. Go take out some burnout billboards, break some road rules. Find some new shortcuts, or something big to jump off. Just explore, people. Know your enemy, and know your battlefield. This is Atomica for Crash FM. That's actually true. You always need to use, you always need to use your um. Or, or no, no, no. You always need to know your battlefield and your enemies. Race south to the It's like what um state. Matt Webster said. Um. If you had more experience in this game, and then the other guy is, or, or, if you have more experience than the other guy, you're more than you're more likely to beat him or her in events or in an event. Kind of like you suck. <laughs> My God, these AIs—they can't drive for crap. <laughs> it's funny. Easy drag strip race. Alright. Upgrade and two wins.
Look out for the Hunter Manhattan driving around the streets. If you see it, shut it down to add it to your car collection. So we're gonna be shutting down Christine. The the car, not anything else. And in the next episode, which is episode eight, we are going to be driving the Manhattan and just do more races in it. But we're not ending the video now. Unless if the Manhattan shows up out of nowhere and wants me to take it down, then I'll gladly take it down. I... Damn it, traffic car. Um, I don't think it wants to show up, so... We'll do the um, burning roof. As I say that, it shows up. We're gonna take him down, then do the burning roof! Damn it. Taste the wall. Taste the concrete slab. The Hunter Manhattan has been delivered to your junkyard. Nice. Now we go for the burning route. Uh, and then after the burning route, we will end off the video. Or no, no, no. Southwest to Lone Stallion Ranch. The clock is. When we get into the junkyard and then come out with the uh, Manhattan, that's when we end the video. God, the idling sound so good. Let's go. Move out of my way. Traffic nut. That's clearly what they're called if they keep doing that. Traffic nuts. Grippy for a 1960s car. Literally. Where the hell are you taking me, game? Oh, there we go. That's a great car. Freaking $20 million just to own this thing. I would say it's like pretty good, but if you only had $20 million, then you'll become pretty broke. But if you were like a multi billionaire, then do as you please. Now let's try to crash in style. Not again! Never mind. Feel in the burn. Yeah, boy. One more win. For that win, you're being awarded the sensational Rossellini LM track package. A sweet set of wheels. Nice. Very, very sweet. Indeed, yes. So now we're going to go into the garage and pick up the uh, Christine Mobile or Manhattan. And yes, if you're wondering, my phone has a lot more storage because it's an iPhone 8 Pro. Or iPhone 8 Plus, not iPhone 8 Pro. Those don't exist, but iPhone 8 Pluses do, yes. Maybe I could send it to my computer so then I can upload the videos from there. And here we go. It's at the 14 minute mark as well. Jeez. LM track package. This is the Golf version of the uh, Ferrari. Correct me if I'm wrong. And for some reason, that kind of reminds me of the uh, LM Classic from Burnout Revenge. And there is the Manhattan. Ugh. And we're only going to fix the uh, originals.
Actually, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fix this car up and then end the video. Six door! Not really. <laughs> it's just a flat spin. Anyone can do that. 15 minute mark, jeez. Well, I guess I am dead from this extreme weight of this pink mobile. You know what this kind of reminds me of? Since it's pink. What is it called? It's that one car from The Simpsons. Not the uh, Homer mobile or whatever it is. Ugh. Traffic check. Alright, we're gonna fix the car. Bam. Fixed. Alright. End of episode number seven. Or eight, I'm not sure. I'm sure it's seven. Maybe eight. Adios.